A breakout in the horror movie Us, Shahadi Wright Joseph is now making her mark in Them. The new horror anthology series follows a Black family who moves out West in the 50s, where their dream life soon turns into a nightmare. intense. What was your reaction when you first read this script? When I first started reading the script, it was almost like I was reading a good book. It was just so interesting. And every script left you with this amazing cliffhanger that you just had to keep reading. And I feel like that's exactly what the show does as well, because I binged it all in one night. Um, <laughs> but I was so excited to start working on it because I had never seen a horror project so powerful that takes place in the Jim Crow era, you know, and something so terrifying as that you know it was very mind-blowing just to read and I was very excited to get to work with little Marvin and one of my idols Lena Waithe and I'm so glad that I got to work with my amazing cast as well did you all guys work together in any way before how'd you build that chemistry when we first met each other we went out to dinner a couple of times and we would kind of just keep bonding as a family as the show went on and sometimes our little family we would go out to the movies and we would go <laughs> out you know different places to just hang out and talk as people and we had this amazing relationship talk to us about your character ruby ruby lee emery is the daughter of henry and lucky emery and she is a big sister she is a freshman going into high school and she's struggling with finding her own identity while also battling being harassed by her white counterparts at her own school you know of her being the only black girl at her high school it's very very difficult for her just me being a black girl and pulling from my own experiences of colorism or racism but also just being a teenager and figuring out myself and you know figuring out my adolescence and and just life I know how confusing that can be so I got to pull from that experience to really make the character realistic how did you wrap your head around like how much work did you have to do to really get a sense of what that time in history was like I did have to learn a lot about the uh, the great migration I didn't know much about the traveling of you know black families from the um from the south to the west coast I didn't know much about that I also didn't know that Compton used to be a predominantly white neighborhood you know because when you think of Compton you mostly think of it as predominantly black it was such a great experience it was almost like an immersive history lesson just being in <laughs> <laughs> just being in the time period and in the costume and in the makeup and the hair, everything just felt so realistic. You know, I'm older than you. I don't know if you gauge that. <laughs> but, but to be able to see movies and project and TV shows now that, you know, where the lead characters are, you know, Black Americans is yeah. so satisfying for me. And it is. I wonder for you as an actress, how that feels to you. I mean, even though I'm, I'm, I'm kind of young, I'm only 15, but you know, there was a point in time where I don't remember seeing people that looked like me on the screen. And the type of representation that is being put into different films and series today, I'm very proud of, you know, there's a trajectory. So I'm very happy to see people that look like us. Well, you can do it all, right? So let's talk about how you got your start on Broadway in The Lion <laughs> King and School of Rock. <laughs> I read somewhere that you started dance lessons at two. <laughs> yes, I did. Yeah, I did. Um, I started dancing at my parents' dance studio. So they put me into dance, me and both my sister as well. And then when I turned eight, my mom heard about an audition for the Lion King on Broadway on the radio. So she was like, oh my God, you should try out for this. And then I realized that I wanted to act more than to be a dancer. Um, so then I kept auditioning and I kept auditioning and that was my first audition ever. And I booked the role and that's where I really found my love for it. And that's where I realized that I want to do this for the rest of my life. Love everything that you're doing. I want to let everybody know that Them is streaming now on Amazon Prime. Shahadi, thank you so much. Thank you so much for having me.